in silico pseudo latin for in silicon alluding to the mass use of silicon for computer chips is an expression meaning performed on computer or via computer simulation", in reference to biological experiments. The phrase was coined in 1989 as an allusion to the Latin phrases in vivo, in vitro, and in situ, which are commonly used in biology see also systems biology and refer to experiments done in living organisms, outside living organisms, and where they are found in nature, respectively. History The expression in silico was first used in public in 1989 in the workshop, "'Cellular Automata, Theory and Applications", in Los Alamos, New Mexico. Pedro Miramontes, a mathematician from National Autonomous University of Mexico presented the report. DNA and RNA physiochemical constraints, cellular automata and molecular evolution. In his talk, Miramontes used the term in silico to characterize biological experiments carried out entirely in a computer. The work was later presented by Miramontes as his PhD dissertation. In silico has been used in white papers written to support the creation of bacterial genome programs by the Commission of the European Community. The first reference paper where in silico appears was written by a French team in 1991. The first referenced book chapter where in silico", appears was written by Hans B. Seberg in 1990 and presented during a summer school on complex systems at the Santa Fe Institute. The phrase, in silico, originally applied only to computer simulations that modeled natural or laboratory processes in all the natural sciences, and did not refer to calculations done by computer generically. Topic: Drug discovery with virtual screening. In silico study in medicine is thought to have the potential to speed the rate of discovery while reducing the need for expensive lab work and clinical trials. One way to achieve this is by producing and screening drug candidates more effectively. In 2010, for example, using the protein docking algorithm EDOC see protein ligand docking, researchers found potential inhibitors to an enzyme associated with cancer activity in silico. 50% of the molecules were later shown to be active inhibitors in vitro. This approach differs from use of expensive high-throughput screening HTS robotic labs to physically test thousands of diverse compounds a day often with an expected hit rate on the order of 1% or less with still fewer expected to be real leads following further testing see drug discovery. Cell models Efforts have been made to establish computer models of cellular behavior. For example, in 2007 researchers developed an in silico model of tuberculosis to aid in drug discovery, with the prime benefit of its being faster than real-time simulated growth rates, allowing phenomena of interest to be observed in minutes rather than months. More work can be found that focus on modeling a particular cellular process such as the growth cycle of Colobacter crescentis. These efforts fall far short of an exact, fully predictive, computer model of a cell's entire behavior. 
limitations in the understanding of molecular dynamics and cell biology as well as the absence of available computer processing power force large simplifying assumptions that constrain the usefulness of present in silico cell models. Genetics <inaudible> 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 Digital genetic sequences obtained from DNA sequencing may be stored in sequence databases, be analyzed see sequence analysis, be digitally altered or be used as templates for creating new actual DNA using artificial gene synthesis. Other examples. In silico computer based modeling technologies have also been applied in whole cell analysis of prokaryotic and eukaryotic hosts e.g. E. coli, B. subtilis, yeast, CHO or human cell lines bioprocess development and optimization e.g. optimization of product yields Simulation of oncological clinical trials exploiting grid computing infrastructures, such as the European Grid Infrastructure, for improving the performance and effectiveness of the simulations. Analysis, interpretation and visualization of heterologous data sets from various sources e.g. genome, transcriptomy or proteome data Protein design one example is Rosetta Design, a software package under development and free for academic use. <laughs> See also <laughs>